Hey guys, it's Sarah Mulner, your Team Beach Body Coach and NCCPT Personal Trainer. I am sitting in my hammock. This is my view from Mexico. It's beautiful, absolutely gorgeous day. The winds are blowing through the palm trees and I cannot believe this is my life. I can't believe this is a trip that I won for doing exactly what I love to do. So I just wanna to talk to you guys about opportunity and dreams because I really truly believe I was knocked down when I became a beach body coach, I was nervous. I was so scared. I was scared I was gonna lose money. I was like, was it a scam? Even when I became a coach, I thought, was it a scam? Like, what's the deal? It's too good to be true. And then I really realized it's not. And this vacation has been my aha moment of meeting with different coaches. And I have to admit, this might sound funny, but you know, I've only been in this business 10 months. So there's like, you know, 2,000 coaches here. And it's, I know, maybe three. So you see these teams together and all these people together. And I was talking with um, one of the um, top coaches and she hit the nail on the head and I wasn't giving myself the benefit of the doubt. She's like, um, hello, you've only been in this 10 months. You are the one that people should be talking to. You know, these people have been here for years. You know, most people that are on this trip have been a coach for two or three years. So for you to earn it in from June to November, she goes, that's amazing. And I thought to myself, why do I always have to second guess everything? Why can't I just stop and enjoy it? Which trust me, I'm enjoying it. But I think it's because we have this doubt about ourselves and feeling like it should take this much time to do something of value. Or it should take a certain amount of time to do something worth being, you know, a part of that, you know, you're not validated enough. And, you know, I'm always second guessing everything that I do and second guessing what I tell you guys and, you know, in my accountability groups, really pushing them because I truly believe I am the brain in their body until they start to believe in themselves. Yet, I don't do it for myself and I don't know why I'm that way. So I'm really trying to take a step back and realize that I got this because I believed in something. I believed in my challengers. I believed in the people that I coached. I taught my coaches exactly what I did in that certain amount of time to become successful and I realized that my whole pay it forward is to help my coaches so that the next trip they're standing all around me and we're going to dinner together and my whole team is there you know bonding and having the best time of our life and I realized I don't have my whole team here because I just created it so I should feel honored that I am here and I am honored but I think we just are always trying to push back on something else because it's too good to be true and trust me every single moment that I'm here it's good, too good to be true like meeting the trainers that are you know I do their videos and I've you know seen them on TV and you know you see them and they're they're just authentic you know and I was telling my team you know Shanti gives the best hugs it wasn't just like hey how you doing it was like this mm, hug that I actually got nervous and I like stepped away a little bit in the picture because I was just nervous I was invading his face or whatever and just Tony Horton is completely silly and ridiculous and Autumn is just so sweet and genuine and it's just been fantastic having breakfast with the CEO 10 months ago never like I was like oh Carl Deichler I know who that is oh my gosh you know but to know I had breakfast with him and you know being a part of this elite reception here with you know people that have been in the business for so long the top of the top and you know it's just it's truly been humbling but my message is you know they say anything worth getting is putting your all into it and that's when you reap the rewards but I really believe that if this is your passion, it's not that hard of work because you're just helping people and you're being their cheerleader and you're being their motivator. And I can tell you that I'm not walking around like it's the Playboy Mansion here. There are people of all shapes, sizes, everything. And we're all here because we motivated people and we inspired people and we brought them on our journey. So don't think you have to be this cookie cutter coach because God knows I am a work in progress. Lots of people are still works in progress. So don't doubt yourself on that. And I'm gonna work on myself on not doubting myself. So I'm gonna take a little snooze. Here's my view. Um, this is my hammock. Bloop. 
I'm going to take a little snooze on my hammock. But I hope you guys have a happy, healthy day. And stop doubting yourself. And call me out if I doubt myself. Alright, chat soon.